So therefore, it is best to see if there is a technique, if there is a reliable technique, a reliable method of waking up to a, to a inner reality from where the judgment does not require that you ask anybody, but you know you are awake. So, and that is possible in all of us. So it's a, it's, a, it's a big game going on here. This is a whole creation of a big game. If you know it's a game, you'll enjoy it. And if you think it's real, you'll cry. It's obvious. If you know that it's a great movie going on, you will watch and enjoy it, no matter what happens. Because you'll wake up one day and find it was not real. People ask me this question, you seem to be praising the Creator for a great job done. You think it's a great job done to create so much evil, to create so much cruelty, so much torture, so much happening in this world? What kind of Creator was that who thought this is going to be enjoying something? My answer was simple. You go and see all the torture on the movies and the screen. Have you ever got up from your chair and said, no, I want to stop it? Have you ever said, oh, I don't like this scene and you run and tear up the screen? You sit there, you don't move from your chair. Why? You know, just a movie. Supposing you have a nightmare, a terrible dream in which bad things have happened. And then you wake up. Don't you say, thank God it was just a dream? Thank God the nightmare was just a dream, it was not real. Don't you think if this is like that, set up like that, and you'll awaken from it, and you'll awake and find that the whole thing was set up exactly like a dream? You say, thank God, it was just created as an experience. Then, but why create this experience in the first place? Can the mind find out a reason why any reasonable creator would create scenes like this, nightmares like this, in a real, real, world looks, looks so real and then say, I did a good job. Even though it's unreal, why create such, such kind of experiences in an unreal world which looks real? Answer is very simple. That unless you have these experiences, how will you know what the value of the peace and bliss in your own home is? How will you know that when you awaken to your true reality, that that's such a wonderful place? if you have nothing to compare it with. Do you know we don't appreciate anything in this world till we have seen the opposite of it?